ETFinalScore.com has East Texas high school sports covered. And now you can take it with you. Get the latest scores for Friday Night Football, articles and videos. Focus in on Dotney photo galleries and more. So don't miss a thing and get your ETFinalScore.com app today. Good afternoon, East Texas. I'm Dawn Rhodes, and this is your Tyler Paper Midday News Update. The Dallas Cowboys are moving to Frisco. Well, at least their team headquarters is. The official announcement is set to come this, early this afternoon, according to our news partners at KYTX CBS 19. But details are already out about the team's new development plans in Collin County, which will replace the team's current Valley Ranch facility. The project is scheduled to open in 2016. Frisco City Council approved the $110 million construction project last night. It will be financed through current sales tax revenue. The deal includes an indoor practice field, which will also be the home stadium for all Frisco high schools. The Cowboys have agreed to pay for the operating and maintenance costs of the facility, which Frisco plans to surround with a huge entertainment district with the idea of turning the area into a major North Texas tourist attraction. Here's what's going viral on YouTube today. Certified diva impressionist Christina Bianco performs Bonnie Tyler's classic 80s power ballad, Total Eclipse of the Heart, in the voices of 19 other divas, including Adele, Cher, Barbara Streisand, Britney Spears, Kristen Chenoweth, and Julie Andrews. Here's a clip with the singing as Bette Midler. Bette Midler! Police may be involved in a guitarist marriage proposal, and George Lucas welcomes a baby girl. That and more in AP Showbiz Minute. AP Showbiz Minute. A grand romantic gesture by the guitarist of Guns N' Roses has kicked off a police investigation. Darren Jay, DJ Ashber, thanked the Las Vegas Police Department for a private helicopter tour over the city before he proposed to his girlfriend. Now an internal affairs investigation is being carried out to clarify if any regulations were violated in granting the ride-along. Race-based claims in a lawsuit against Paula Dean have been thrown out. Lisa Jackson sued Dean and her brother, saying she suffered from sexual harassment, racially offensive talk and employment practices that were unfair to black workers. But a judge says Jackson has no standing to sue them for racial discrimination. This is the claim that led to Dean losing a big slice of her culinary empire. Star Wars creator George Lucas and his new wife have a baby daughter. Everest Hobson Lucas was born via surrogate on Friday. 69-year-old Lucas and Melody Hobson were married in June. This is Hilary Fox with AP Showbiz Minute. Thanks for watching and watch for more video news updates throughout this afternoon.